to Hybrid Harmony, a game that is currently in demo mode, so it's gonna be like a short playthrough, but I wanted to show you guys what Hybrid Harmony is about. I was reached out by the team to show off this game, and when it comes to demo games, you obviously know there is a Kickstarter below in the description if you guys want to help fund this game to make it a full game in the future. The Kickstarter ends on August 14th, so it's gonna be quite a while until it ends, but I don't know when I'm editing this and uploading it, so who knows if it's actually almost done or not. But Hybrid Harmony is a visual novel I wanted to try because it's different from most of the visual novels I played this year, only solely because this is a romantic comedy and I feel like I don't play them enough. I feel like the only one I really played is XOXO Droplets and I don't know if they considered themselves a romantic comedy in that one. This one is also not an Otomi from what I can guess from the story that they've given me. So the story goes, Hybrid Harmony is a romantic comedy visual that takes place in a modern fantasy world filled with mythical creatures, magic, and hybrids. Hybrids are people that are a mixture between human and mythical race. An example of mermaids, werewolves, leprechauns, Lamia. I don't know what Lamia is, but I know what the other three are. <laughs> You play as Matt Cooper, a human intern into an all-hybrid school through a special program, special social program. During your time at the school, you'll follow one of four routes, where you'll meet some truly magical characters, go on life-changing adventures, and fall in love. So I don't know how long this demo is, but I can already tell that I'm in love with this gazebo. <laughs> I'm very obsessed with like gazebos and nature of the sorts. But let's begin. On our adventure here as who? Matt Cooper. This demo's condensed version of Hybrid Harmony's prologue scenes. Choices and certain features have been cut for purposes of this demo and will be added into the full game. Aspects of this demo will be tweaked and adjusted when the full game is released, such as the pacing, journal UI, phone system, <laughs> and various other things. Criticism and advice is greatly appreciated. I hope you enjoy this demo and have fun. I love phone features. Ooh! Can I already click it? Oh, hell yeah. Can I change my wallpaper already? <laughs> Not even touching the game uh, dialogue yet. I'm just messing with the phone. Okay, let's go with like in between this one and this one. Let's go with this purple one. Town board. Selling playing, guard, playing cards. Redwood forest weirdness. New gem appraisal shop community form. If I click these. Ah, okay. So, oh my god, this person wrote a bunch. Okay, okay. School board. Welcome to the new students. Looking for actors. Do you want to rock? Do you like, love, rock, metal, grindcore, and want to buy merch of, of, of auditions? Of, wait, what? <laughs> I feel like I had to talk louder because it capitalized everything. Deleted post. This post has been deleted by user J Wormwood. Who's that? Alright. Dad and mom, my only contacts. How do I keep plants from dying? Where are there, where are there gardeners near me? Is my Wi-Fi down? Why isn't the internet working? Hello, you stupid website. Why does it hurt when I pee? Dad, I'm not the internet. Ew, why does it hurt when I pee? Daddy, I got kidney stones. Oh my god, my mom brewed a lot. Hiya, son. Just wanted to text you because I was thinking about you at work. Lol. XXX. What is XXX? Is that hugs? Because XOXO is hugs and kisses, right? I'm assuming XXX is hugs. Jenny showed me pics of her baby and it makes me think of you when you were little. You were a lot cuter than Jenny's baby, but don't tell her that. It amazes me how quickly you've grown. You're not my tiny little baby no more. You're a man. Where has all the time gone? I miss when we were closer than anything and we're together all the time. I remember pushing on the swings and love hearing you laugh. Hello, Matt. Please answer me. Are you ignoring me? What are you doing? I know you want your independence, but you'll miss me when I'm long gone and buried. Where are you, son? Are you okay? Why are you ignoring me, son? Please, I'm really worried I'm about to cry. Mom, I was in the shower. Mom, you texted us in a span of 15 minutes freaking out? That's crazy. All right, well, uh, that's all well and fun <laughs> with the phone. A towering monolith. Of, uh, of a school completely fills my vision as I gaze up and examine the huge building in front of me. Okay, so if you want to see everything without the dialogue in the way, you just middle click your mouse. I was just wondering how uh, I could see CG. <laughs> Over 100 rooms, specialized equipment made to help hybrids of all shapes and sizes, an on-site li library, and gymnasium. 
My previous school was like a daycare center compared to this place. I don't know what any of these characters look like, by the way. The mountainous size of the school perfectly mirrors the high standards that people hold it to. Exeridge Academy is fam I don't know if I pronounced that right. It's famous throughout the country for its prestigious standards and all hybrid history. I'm sorry, my Tamagotchi. Let me turn off the volume. There we go. Well, all hybrid until now, I suppose. I scan over the bustling crowds as hybrids. Am I not a hybrid? Am I a, uh, am I a normie? Of hybrids fumbling through the school gates, horns, wings, and tails seem to feature on almost everyone. A lot of students wear clothes specifically tailored to their fit to, to fit their individual body types. Pixies wear shirts with slits in the back of their wings to fit through. Lamias need only wear the top half of an outfit as they can't fit anything around their snake-like ew, snake ew, ew, what snake? <laughs> snake-like lower halves. I look down and examine my own clothes, my bland t-shirt, plain denim jeans, and hand-me-down sneakers were an attempt to blend into the background and not draw much attention. But with all the variety in everyone's wardrobe, my blandness ironically makes me stick out. Am I just a normie? Is everything alright? Ooh, are you a uh, professor? A crimson haired winged woman with horns approach. Oh, that took me way too long to figure out the term. Horns approaches me with a puzzle. Look, most likely confused as to why I'm just idly standing here staring at my clothes. Yeah, I'm fine. I was just looking at my shoes. MC, you're so awkward. My words awkwardly stumble from my mouth. I don't think I've ever met a more naturally beautiful looking woman in my life. Met a more naturally beautiful... What does that mean? Like, do you consider girls with makeup not natural? Or... I don't know. I, the word natural here in this time... Uh, this... This... This scenario here... It could be anything. Because this... Is it the hybrid natural or is a regular human more natural for him? I don't know. Is that why you've been standing here for so long? Is there something wrong with your shoes? No, they're fine. I just... Who are you? <laughs> this woman lets out a giggle and open hands towards me. I, I, I outstretch my sweaty palm and shake it. Miss Scarlet, I'm a history... Oh, history? I love history. You're going to be my favorite teacher. I'm a history teacher here at Ax Axeridge. She slips her hand away from mine and returns it to her hip. I'm guessing you're the new student. Matt, wasn't it? Whoa, 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 whoa. Isn't this a college? Shouldn't you guys have multiple new students? Or is it just rare for new students to come in? Yeah, how did you know? The completely lost look in your eyes gave it away. There has been more than me here. Plus, there's been quite a buzz about you for a while. What? You're- Oh, I am- I am the first human! You're the first human to attend this school, after all. I don't know if you did any prior research, but this school has ex has been exclusively all hybrid for centuries now. Well, I don't know if you guys did your research when you looked at my fucking application to realize I'm the- the- uh, human. <laughs> you could have rejected me if you wanted to make this an all hybrid forever. I'm just saying. I'm sure Adam Axer is rolling in his grave. Yeah, I'm sure. Miss Scarlet clearly notices my trepidation and bears a smile like that of a caring mother. I'm only joking, sweetie. I'm more, ha more than happy to welcome any kind of new student here. Whether you're a human or hybrid or an alien from Mars. Thanks. What kind of hybrid are you anyway, if you don't mind me asking? Not at all. I'm a sucky... Oh, of course. Of course. Of course. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get out. Come on. I'm a sucky this year. Okay, that's cool. I don't know much about succubi, save for the whole seductive aspect. Uh-oh. <laughs> we trail off into an uncomfortable silence, so my hands vaguely wave and squeeze the air in front of me, almost to mime the word seductive. <laughs> Why would you do that? I'm just gonna... I'm just, I'm just gonna head inside. <laughs> that sounds like a good idea. Your first lesson's with me this morning, so I recommend just dropping your bag up with you. <laughs> dropping your bag off in your locker and heading to class. Do you need any help to find your way around? No, thanks, I'll be fine. I think I'll be fine. I took a tour around school a couple weeks ago, and I think I remember where everything is. Alright, then I hope you have a great first day, Matt. I hate, I hate it the first day of school when you're in new school and you don't know where anything is. And then my dad will be like, okay, bye! And then I'm like, no! Nah. <laughs> And with the awkward encounter finally over, Miss Scarlet returns to her post near the side of the school gates. I lurch forwards, 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 
maybe grammar issue i don't know my grammar is terrible too passing through the gates and officially beginning my new life at axeridge academy for some reason i thought at that moment like uh, an anime op would just randomly start up i saw there through the thin gaps that formed in between students weeping through crowds that fill the hallways my eyes fixated on the walls in search of my new locker vibrant posters litter the walls and notice boards advertising upcoming sport sporting events and clubs like quest friends role-playing club and sweet treats baking club hey those those two clubs sound great but i'll probably go to the sweet treats because i want sweet treats <laughs> The only clubs we had at my old school were an after-school math club and a French cinema appreciation appre appreciation club, which only had one member. Aw, as I continued through the hall, I can't help but pick up on bits and pieces of people's conversations. Things like human, new guy, and my own name stick out and seem louder than they actually are. I wonder what people think of me. The first human at Axe Ridge Academy. I wonder what he's like. Why do we have to have a human at the school? Humans are so boring. They can't fly or do magic or breathe underwater. He totally doesn't belong here. Axe Ridge has always been all hybrid. And now this guy shows up and ruins the entire history that the school is built on. What a joke. Hey, you don't need that kind of peer pressure happening on you. When, I mean, maybe you should have done your own research too when you're applying to this place. But the person who accepted you also knew you were human so the guy looks like a total boy from here i'm gonna go ask for his number hey that's a good compliment okay one of those things is definitely less likely than the others <laughs> finally i spy my locker and number 0133 i emerge from the gossiping crowd and head towards it i will open the door and stare into the empty space i turn back and peek inside the lo open lockers that surround me all of which are overflowing with memories and personality pictures of friends and trinkets from outings cover the inside of everyone's lockers am i in college or am i in a high school i'm a little confused <laughs> am i like just super late to the to coming to school what the fuck was i doing the whole time it's a witch reflecting who the owners are and their lives at the school mine like the one at my old school is empty i was under the assumption we were in college mom what was the messages again because from the sounds of it it sounds like i'm in college but from this situation scenario here it feels like i'm in high school <laughs> i let my backpack into the locker with the side didn't have any friends at my previous school and i doubt this one will be any different especially now that i stick out like a chocolate bar in a swimming pool that's disgusting maybe it's for the best that i just lie low and keep my head down yeah sure lie low as you are the only human in the school i mean the whole reason i was chosen for this program was because of the risk oh because the risk of me making the schools look bad it was so low what the whole reason I was chosen for this program was because the risk of me making the schools look bad was so low. How? I think it'd be best if I simply keep to myself and don't draw any attention my way. Well, hey, Bojack! <laughs> I'm kidding. Hey, yo! My sudden shrill scream draws in the attention of the surrounding students. So much for lying low. I mean, this guy would definitely scare me, too. I'm not a huge fan of horses, so... Oh, okay, side angle, okay side profile not <laughs> i mean wow you're super jumpy the strange hybrid reels back and lets out a boisterous laugh i can't help but stare almost hypnotized at his well his horse head i knew going into this program that i would be meeting hybrids that i'd never heard of before but i was nowhere near prepared enough to encounter a guy like this for feet to neck he's a completely average guy boring looking even then you get to his well his horse head let me guess, you're freaked out by the horse head, right? That's totally fine. I get that all the time, especially with babies and old people. So you're the new guy, huh? How's your first day been so far? I just walked in like five minutes ago. Cool, cool. What's your name, bro? Um, Matt. Cool, cool. What's your name? My name's Horseface. Thanks for asking. Are you fucking shitting me? Horseface? Is that really your name? Please tell me you're JK. Horseface? Really? Yup, it's a family name. My dad, my mom, my little sis, my grandpa. We all have the same name. That... Wouldn't that be a little confusing? <laughs> your entire family has the same name? Well, no. I got a brother named Terry, but we're ostracized from... Uh, we've ostracized him from the family. Because he has a different name? Nah, he's an arsonist. Ah, uh, makes sense. 
that damn Terry. <laughs> anyway, bro, got any friends yet at this school? I mean, I'm sure you had lots of friends back in your old school. No, I don't have any friends. I literally just got here. How do you make friends within like five minutes of entering a place? That's great. It, excuse me? Horseface rushes out and grabs both of my arms with vigor, squeezing with a surprisingly strong grip. It's great because I'm here to help you. I'm gonna be honest with you, bro. Most of the students at the school don't appreciate my friendship. So I've been in the market for a best friend for a while now. <laughs> what? Oh, wait, I gotta stop the, the episode for today. So I'm, I'll finish this at least. So let's be friends, bro. Horses and humans go together like vampires and blood, like relish or bananas, like my dad and drinking. Oh my god. I keep forgetting <laughs> this is like a romantic comedy, so there is gonna be jokes like this. My dad and drinking, bro. <laughs> Dude, do you have daddy issues that you need to talk to us about? This is a free, non-judgmental space here. Because we all have issues. Daddy and mommy. Sir. <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys for watching today's episode. I really hope you guys are enjoying this so far. Again, reminder, their Kickstarter is down below in the description. Uh, I believe attached to the Kickstarter is a download to the demo. But if it's not, there is a... Uh, the game is on Steam, so if you have Steam, just type in Hybrid Harmonies, I believe. Hi That's so bad of me. Yeah, Hybrid Harmony. <laughs> but anyway, thank you guys for watching today's episode. Stay beautiful, and I will see you guys in the next one with horse face hair. <laughs>